really drinking it on that dick in it. Maybe pink's a little much. Hey, honey, what's cooking for dinner? These titties. God! That was an ab workout. Good morning, my loves. Welcome back to today's vlog, which is actually going to be a haul. And I'm actually really excited for this haul because today we are going to be hauling over $600 worth of pink clothes only. That's it. Pinkity, pinkity on my drinkity, dickity. That's it for me. And this is all due thanks to Fashion Nova. If you guys already don't know, they're sponsoring today's video, but also my entire closet is pretty much, I would say about 80% Fashion Nova, but it is also about 80% pink now. And I'm so excited to add all of this to my pink collection. I feel like you guys don't even realize that this is an all pink haul. You guys are like, that looks like just a part of Stephanie's closet. Because of how much pink I've been wearing these days and I'm so glad to have my fiance here with me to help judge these clothes oh my god I saw the best comment on a different vlog it was like I love Stephanie but her style genuinely confuses me <laughs> but like same so the first piece that I got and I know that you guys know that I like to keep everything on hangers for a couple of days before I haul it so that it can just unwrinkle itself I don't actually iron them so this is the first piece I actually tried this one on and it is kind of like your candy cane nurse type of esque outfit like you know what everyone dresses up as a nurse with a little hat this is kind of like I think there's a word for this style leave it in the comments because it's completely brain farted out of my brain cells kind of almost like a pink denim but not very heavy or thick so it's very wearable and breathable with these little buttons they're high quality buttons <gasps> I just noticed this it's really like pants at the top they have like the little pant holes I love stuff where it has like small details that are unique oh. honestly very it good. takes about 32 minutes to put the dress on but when you put this on it's not as tight and as crazy as you think it's gonna be. Halfway through it, I almost gave up on the buttons. I was like, this is not gonna work. Whatever I've got going on is not gonna shuffle itself into this dress, but it actually fits and it's super comfortable and I feel like I could eat a good meal in this. It is a little bit short and not to like come for Fashion Nova and like steal their career, snatch their wig and like brush their weave, but look at this. No, no, no. Let me show you something. I feel like it looks cuter open. What's with Let me see how Maybe just one button? Okay, two is too much? Yeah, I got a little <laughs> over ambitious, okay? I like the button. <laughs> <laughs> super pink because it's like five different variations of the color pink and I love matching sets because it just makes your life easier and whoop bam whoop bam I think this is so cute it's kind of like your athletic workout set it's purple it's bright pink it's blue it's white it's like lilac there's just a lot going on this is a very very colorful piece I love the shorts they feel so comfortable they fear oh oh my god cute <laughs> even cuter me, I'm like, it's so cute. Oh, oh it's so cute. Oh my god, look at this. I thought this was cute. And then this is even cuter. Loser. You know what? Don't be rude, okay? So I think this is gonna look so freaking cute. I love sets like this. Would I actually wear it to the gym? Probably not. Like, I feel like you have to have a banging body to wear this to the gym. This is more like running errands. This is more like grabbing a cup of coffee type of thing. But it's not actually gym wear. I mean, you could. You would just have to have a lot of confidence. I don't say this really often, but when I do, I really mean it. I look so cool. Can you take it off? I think it's better. No, stop making I look like a kimchi girl. I look like I am in a Korean drama and I should be there shaking my leg in the back of my parents' kimchi restaurant. Or, what babe? Did you think about that? No. But I love these pants. It feels so good. It's so freaking comfortable, but the outfit looks put together. Like this is one of those outfits where it's like, it's not too much, you're not doing the most, but you're still like cool, like you're hip. Like you wear this, people are like, she's different. She got a sense of style. You know, maybe I should hit that follow button on Instagram. Please do it at the single button. But, you know, it just kind of looks like, <laughs> it looks kind of cool. The only bad thing is, it really psychs you out. You think that there's gonna be pockets and there's none. Pocket okay, right here. It's not real. <gasps> it's real. <laughs> what the, I had a burrito in here. 
This is burrito pocket. Imagine keeping a warm, toasty burrito in here. Okay, girl. It's a really well-functioning pocket. Like this is something that people will die for. Business will die for this pocket. This is a movie theater outfit. <laughs> oh my gosh, it is! And then you catch the crumbs in here and then you zip it back up, you get home and you dust it out. And that is what I call I almost smacked. I almost smacked him in the face with the bread. And that's what I call a multi-functional outfit. You ain't never seen nothing like this. I'm just saying. Next thing that I got, I'm so freaking excited about. You guys know that my entire life goal, my life search, is not even to find my significant other. It's not to find the one that I'm gonna Same. marry. <laughs> but it's to find different variations of a normal jean jacket. And I feel like a jean jacket is such a staple. Everybody wears a jean jacket. So I try to find different variations of your normal jean jacket. I got a black one, I got a white one. And now, I have a pink one. It's an oversized pink jean jacket. It's pretty heavy like it feels very high quality but it doesn't feel super thick and so structured sometimes I don't love structured jean jackets because I feel like it could make you look very bulky like I have this one jean jacket so cute but I have to wear it off the shoulder like at least at all times one shoulder has to be off and do you know how hard it is to like actually do daily normal people things like run errands when you've got like one jean jacket hanging off your shoulder so I don't really love structured jean jackets this one's like kind of structured but not enough so it's perfect I think I hope. The next thing that I got, I got this on sale. I think it was like $8, which is nuts. It's from Fashion Nova and it's this nice little clear bag. I thought this would be perfect for the summer. I love that the little handles are squared cutouts and they're like this, I don't even know what to call it, but this mauve pink look. It's perfect because this is actually not attached. I saw a lot of oh, clear like plastic that. bags, yeah where this is actually attached to the bottom and that sucks because now this is versatile. Like you could just wear this or you could just put this into other bags if you need like a makeup bag. This is like the perfect size. It's massive, it's big, I like or- it for some reason. Me too, or you could throw it in here. But I kind of like it without as well. So it just looks, I just love the pink detailing on this one. I feel like it's so summery and like clear bags are in. So I got that one. And I also got another bag, which this one's a little bit more intense for sure. This is a little bit more, um, not as easy to digest is all I'll say about that. What is this puffer jacket? neon, uh, glittery material. But like, look at how cute. Oh, that looks good with this. Right? Honey, you don't just stick it. Oh, you fix it. <laughs> you don't just stick it in, is that what you said? Because I'm greed, I'm just right. kidding. Also, since we're on the topic of accessories, Look at this. Whoa, I like that. Don't you like it? I do. Wow, everything looks so pretty in pink. Oh yeah? Holy shit. Honestly, things look so much better right now. Things are looking up. These are literally what people say rose tinted glasses. When you like somebody and everything's rose tinted glasses. Wow, this looks so good. Honey, try it on. Wow. I told you. Wow. It looks better in pink than night. Wow, this is cool. Futuristic. And then the next things that I got. Oh my god, I'm kind of so excited. I can't believe I haven't worn these yet. I actually brought one of these pairs to Paris and I didn't wear it because I wanted to perfectly match it with a different outfit and then I ended up getting sick and then never wore any of those outfits. And so these are the shoes that I took to Paris. These are Parisian shoes, babe. They've been everywhere. They've been to Betty. So these are very fancy. Big, chunky, heeled. Um, what would you even call this? Super strappy, beautifully pink shoes. I think they're so adorable. I'm usually a seven and a half, but I got an eight in these, so maybe size up half a size just in case. And it fits perfectly like a glove. It's like a suede material. This ribboning is suede, so it doesn't feel like it's gonna, kind of like, sometimes when I have strappy shoes and it just is like this string. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? The strappy shoes with the strings, like the stilettos, and it makes you look like a burnt sausage, like sausage casings on your your calves like I didn't want that and these are just super comfortable you are falling asleep you will wake up and love the color pink beats sleep <laughs> and the next pair that I got that I don't think is gonna be as practical slash functional as normal day wear as the other one but they're legally blonde pink 
fluffy shoes, bits. Like how freaking cute are these? I can't imagine a cuter pair of shoes than these pink shoes. This is everything that I wanted to be in life in a shoe. She's pink, she's a stiletto, she's got little pink fluff on the top. This is very girly, very feminine, but also could be very sexy. And now this is the type of shoe that I probably won't wear with the all pink outfit like the other pair because this should be the statement piece. These I also got in a size 8M, which I don't know what the M stands for. Medium? Maybe. Because I do have wider feet, so I'm pretty sure if I have the choice. Meaty. <laughs> Ain't meaty, okay? Another jean jacket from Fashion Nova, but in pink, but this time it's cropped. And ooh, they always come like this, and it like it's it's amazing that they come like this, but it's also really annoying because I have to take it off. Oh, I love this. Wow, Fashion Nova always does this thing, which is like good for the buttons, I'm sure, but it's really annoying for me as a consumer because I'm a lazy ass bitch that they cover their buttons with these like little paper wrappings, which is actually very good for the buttons. When I took the paper off just now, I thought it was gonna be like your regular jean jacket buttons, like those buttons, which are still high quality buttons, very nice buttons, but they're actually white buttons. When you undo the paper on it, they're actual white buttons. So cool. It looks so cool. It's like small details like this that makes clothes look bougie. That's an awesome detail. I'm so excited about this one. I got it oversized. When I get crop jackets, I kind of want them to be baggy instead of too tight. I feel like a little bit awkward when I wear crop stuff that's too tight. <laughs> Social experiment. I wanted to just wear everything you should else. Go out like this. I decided maybe it's not exactly. <laughs> Everyone always told me pink's too much, and I said, you know what? You don't know none. And then today, I see it. I see it a little bit. Do you guys see the shoes? <laughs> This outfit. This is pinkity drinkity on that dickity. We've got the pink fanny pack. We've got the pink crop jacket that I've done off the shoulder, 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 but it looks good on too. I'm just saying, this is one of my favorite pieces. This crop pink jacket might wear it out today. And we've got the pink sunglasses. We've got the furry heels. And the next thing that I got, I actually wore in Paris for two days straight because I was sick and then I couldn't change. I fell asleep in this like two days in a row. Oh, I think this is the outfit that I fell asleep in for 11 hours. I'm pretty sure. This one? <laughs> yeah. It is this jumpsuit with this really silky, nice mauve pink material. It's super comfortable. It looks bougie. She's silky. She's not super wrinkly. I just really liked this one. You liked this one too. I'm sorry. I was too busy being a boss bitch to hear what you just said to me, boo. But this really makes me feel like a boss bitch. I love when you wear an outfit and suddenly you're a completely different vibe. It looks relaxed, it looks fun, it looks like a vacation outfit, but it looks very expensive. I don't know if it's the color mixed with the material or one or the other, but something about it is very comfortable, very airy, a lot of movement involved. Bottle cap challenge was good, was poppin'. And then the next thing that I got, this outfit. It means so much to me already because we started our house hunting series in this outfit. We saw a bunch of houses in this outfit from like house one through six or something, which is just marbles. It comes with a belt. I love the belt on this one because it's like this beautiful circle belt. It's kind of like a suede material. I don't know how to just feel it, feel it, feel it, touch it. I like it. I don't know what material it, it is really though. Cool. Yeah, I don't know how to describe it. Very, very comfortable. I mean, very practical. I've already worn it. It's a romper. I wore this to my ColourPop shoot. I mean, this has been well worn, well loved already, and she just looks brand new still. And she doesn't smell brand new. I should have washed it first, sorry. What do you think? So you guys already saw this for my house hunting episodes. It's such a comfortable romper. It's probably one of my favorite rompers. And the main reason that I, oops, sorry. I got this one mainly because I have like the short and the shirt set from, it's like a blue color. Do you remember that in my last haul? It was so cute, it was so comfortable. And I ordered this thinking that it was gonna be a set, but it ended up being a romper. And I think I love it a little bit more. I don't love it when I have to pee, but I love the way that it fits and it's just so comfortable and you don't have to think too much about your outfit. But also check out these fun shoes. Are they not fun? Very cute. What do you think about them? Very They're fun. so cute. Okay, I must have mistied this one, but the one that is tight, it doesn't give you like that squeezing your intestines, your calves, 
to the deaths of them type of look. That just matches the shirt. Right? It's like the, the same, same material too. Really? It's like that slightly suede material. And then the next piece that I got is this really cute butterfly armed jacket from Fashion Nova. Already wore this to a big shoot that I had with a ramen company. This has been well worn and well loved as well and I just love the fit of this. It's oversized but not too baggy that it kind of overpowers your figure. It's just the cutest color too and it's casual, it's corduroy, it feels good. So on top of that, I love snap buttons because it's like the type where you could just be like, hey honey, what's cooking for dinner? These titty, you know what I mean? But like probably not like that because that's just a really weird thing to say when someone comes up something around the lines like some variation of that saying but also I love the fact that I've worn it so many times that I kept this little plastic piece on and then the next thing that I got is a pair of pink pants so excited about this one and it looks like this I saw it on the model and she just looked so business professional but also like because it's pink it's cute it's fashionista it feels so comfortable and I feel like this is a perfect fit if you guys live in like a kind of like a hotter climate or you want to look cute but your office is hot and stuffy and the AC is broken it just feels airy feel it like it feels like you're just gonna get so much air circulation oh. in there oh this is smooth yeah it feels kind of like silky pajamas let's go like this he's like this is smooth I'm excited about these pants. You guys know I normally don't wear pants and for a lot of different reasons. I just, main thing is I don't find them comfortable but that one feels like it'll be very, very comfortable. Um, I love these pants. I didn't think I was gonna love them as much as I actually do. I paired it with this furry white tank top to add a little bit of like fun texture to this look. The way the length of the pants, the way that it fits all the way through, it's not too tight at the bottom which makes it look a little bit too professional when like the angles get too tight. It definitely looks like work pants. But if it flows out too much, it looks like that pajama look. This is just like the perfect way that it flows and it's just so comfortable. It's airy. I feel like I could shake my tail feathers. This is perfect for like if you guys have like a thesis in college or a presentation or maybe it's like just a slight business casual event. It's a good color. It shows character. It's not your navy gray houndstooth black that everyone's going to be showing up in. But it's just still neutral enough that you can wear it. With that ear too? Yeah, show up with the ears. It's a networking event. You want them to know. Who you are. Like deep inside, personality is everything. So show up like this. This one, I already took an Instagram picture in and then I took it right off so I could haul it. Didn't even take the tag off. And it's this really cute, pretty, feminine, just cutesy, whoopsy, doopsy, pink polka dot dress. Like when people think of pink, this is probably what they think of. Like that cutesy, feminine vibe. And so I had to get something that was like less crazy, less wild, and something that was more femme. This dress is so short, but it is so cute. Wait, what's wrong with your shoulder? <laughs> No? Better. Really? I like no. it up. I Better. think it's so cute. Like polka dot shoulder sleeve with crack a lack of boots. You know? I wanted to pair it with this purple jacket. This jacket That's just really in nice. case. Or like this shit for an Instagram picture. What do you think? I feel like I look trendy. I look cool. The next piece that I got is so freaking wild. And it is this neon pink dress. Mini, mini, mini dress. I'm excited to try this one on, mainly because Fashion Nova had this white two-piece set. I don't know if you guys remember it from a bunch of hauls ago, where it was like this white tube top and the white shorts, and it was made out of like what seems to be the same material, and it's like this thick material, feel it? It's heavy, it's thick. So I was like, I hope it's the same as the white one, and it ended up being the same, and I remember that one thinking, oh my gosh, this is so small, and I just squeezed into it, and it just sucked everything in, so I'm hoping that it does not do me dirty. It does the same thing this time. I got it in a size small. Maybe I should have sized up, but we're about to find out. It comes with a belt and some pockets. I feel like this already has the shape of an Instagram model in the dress. So I'm hoping that like once I step into it, it'll make me an Instagram model. <laughs> this is burning my eyes. It's burning What's my burning eyes. Your eyes. So bright. Oh, you mean the curves? The curves are hard. Yeah, I know. It's a lot to look at, but soak it in, boo boo. <laughs> It stretches, it moves, and it just hugs you 
tightly. It's not too tight where I feel like I'm wearing a corset. I can't breathe. It's got real ass pockets. And this color is very intense. I mean, this is the color that's like, you know how a lot of pinks are very pastel, they're very cute, they're very like, ooh, pinkity drinkity. This one is spank me pink beads. Like, this is a pink. I love this little shoulder strap. I feel like it adds a little bit more character. This is like what you show up to events. You show up to glow up. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I just felt like the dress was a little bit too much. This is like the oversized pink denim jacket because this obviously is not too much. That's gonna be it for today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments which was your favorite piece. Do you guys wear pink a lot? I know a lot of people that are like, I never wear pink. I also saw a lot of comments that are like, I never wore pink until I started watching you and now all I try to buy is pink. If you could only wear one color for the rest of your life, which one would you wear? And also, if you guys wanna see me try different colors, it's gotta be like super colorful colors because I feel like that's what I'm into right now. So if you guys wanna see like an all blue haul, an all yellow haul, an all orange haul, let me know in the comments and I love you guys so much. So much. Like I said, everything will be linked in the description and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh.